Oh, hey there. So in this week's episode, we discuss getting our built cylinder heads home, and my wife gets a new car. Right, on to the intro. Nissan Trinity uh, family dealio. We've actually gone all the way uh, out to Stone Mountain in Georgia to a dealership here to pick up, um, you know, the third piece of the set here. Swing around and yeah, there's the, uh, that's it right there, the Pathfinder. Um, it's an hour and a half to get here and then we had like a bit of a faff. Like we actually test drove the uh, the wrong car. They have two in the same color, same year, and everything. Same. They only have like Pathfinder SV models, anyways. But um, this one, like it has a thousand more miles on it, but is a whole lot cheaper. So we ended up getting that one. Right. So this is the Patriot that Jess is getting rid of, and uh, even in the Jeep forums, like. You get like a lot of hate on it because it's like yeah, it's not a real Jeep. The CVT is trash. It's low. Um, sometimes people ask about miles and make it faster. They just don't want to be so slow. Um, honestly, I think it looks excellent. I like the color on this. Jess will actually flex on other Jeep owners because she bought this brand new in 2007, and uh, that was the only year where this very specific color code was used. It is, uh, I had to check it out, and yeah, she's uh, right. It's uh, even though Jeep had other colors that were like very similar after, this code is like PB6. And if I'm honest, I, I really like it. It's like I've seen um, some Z's wrapped in a shade of blue very similar to this, and they look good. And I want to say I really like the color, but yeah, um, I was, I wasn't even gonna include this Jeep in the video. But I was on my way home from the shop. I was thinking um, of a Jeremy Clarkson quote. Like he was just like driving around his own car. He was talking about like a, a teddy bear um, saying, you know, to anyone else, it just looks like a rotten piece of garbage. Oop, there's no focus there. Yeah, but to him, you know, like it's, it's a sentimental treasure. It's definitely worth keeping, you know. And for her, you know, her first car bought brand new. 13 years ago and she's selling it now for you know for this <laughs> significantly larger car but um it just reminded me of some awesome song lyrics it's like every new beginning is some other beginning's end um geez it's so huge i can't even get the entire thing in the shot i have to back like 50 feet away from it the 2018 nissan pathfinder it's a de yo it's a DE with uh, gas direct injection, which I didn't even know Nissan did. But speaking of, uh, you know, new beginnings, let's take a look at these freshly built heads. All right, so these uh, are the old heads. I've got them sitting on the garage floor here and over here. Um, they're not reusable. I discussed this with him a couple times. He's just saying there's uh, too much metal went through the little oil passages and if we tried to reuse them uh, it would just lose uh, a ton of oil pressure um, so I brought these home pretty much just for show uh, for videos and I might um, practice like uh, porting and polishing my own cylinder heads with these uh, he said like yeah that would be uh, perfect for it um, these are the fresh heads here on the uh, cardboard. So uh, these ones here, uh, like the heads, like they're resurfaced, uh, pressure tested, clean, the valves are all um, uh, lapped in. Uh, they're ready for the install. Uh, you can even see how nice and shiny they are. Ooh. And here's the top view. Um, 
These are the Jim Wolf Tech uh, C8 cams. Uh, they were polished. Um, they were good to go. There was some uh, damage to the, uh, like some scraping on the camshaft journals, but he polished them up really good. It says they're good to go with this uh, fresh set of um, cylinder heads. So uh, our buddy Rocco's coming over this weekend. We will uh, get to work this weekend. Uh, fresh head gaskets. I got uh, pretty much everything for the install. So get it back together. Um, and I'll follow up with a video next week. If you like my videos, feel free to uh, drop a like, uh, comment, and subscribe. All right, until next time.